Hi everyone, Scott Lewis here for Wirefly, here today to bring you a quick look at the T-Mobile My Touch by Huawei. The T-Mobile My Touch by Huawei is replacing the T-Mobile My Touch by LG, which is right here. So I wanted to compare the two just quickly so you can see the differences. Both phones are running Android 2.3 for operating software. I have not seen anything that says the new My Touch is going to be receiving the ice cream sandwich or jelly bean upgrade, which would be Android 4.0 or 4.1. But things always change, so make sure you check the T-Mobile website for updates. Now both of the new and old T-Mobile My Touches have the exact same thickness at 10 millimeters thick, so there's not a profile difference. Now the displays are a little bit different. The old T-Mobile My Touch has a 3.8 inch display, where the new T-Mobile My Touch has a 4 inch display. They have the exact same weight, they are both 4.1 ounces, so the profiles are identical, the screens are just larger on the new T-Mobile My Touch versus the old. The resolution on the new MyTouch is 480 by 800 which is the exact same resolution as in the old MyTouch. With that being said, the new MyTouch has a slightly smaller pixel per inch density of 233 pixels per inch versus the 246 pixels per inch that the older MyTouch had. That's enough comparing the two MyTouches, we're going to go ahead and focus on our brand new T-Mobile MyTouch by Huawei right now. The T-Mobile MyTouch has a 1.5 GHz single core processor along with 1 GB of processor RAM. It also has 4 GB of internal memory, plus an option for a micro SD card that you can slide into it. It does have a VGA quality or 0.3 megapixel front facing camera, as well as a 5 megapixel still image camera on the back with an LED flash. Let's go ahead and continue our tour real quick. We have the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, along with the power and sleep button, the camera shutter button, the micro USB charge port, the volume up and down rocker switch, and then on the back, we have our battery. We have a 1,500 milliamp hour battery. And you can see our micro SD card goes right there along with our SIM card. Something to keep in mind is that the MyTouch is a T-Mobile phone, so it does have GSM capabilities. That means that if you're traveling abroad, the T-Mobile MyTouch will still be able to make calls even while you're outside the country. And that's a quick look at the T-Mobile MyTouch by Huawei. If you have any questions about the MyTouch, please leave them here on our YouTube channel. If you think your friends or family would be interested in the T-Mobile MyTouch, make sure to share our video with them. And if you want to stay up to date on the latest in cell phone technology, make sure to subscribe to our Wirefly YouTube channel. My name is Scott Lewis for Wirefly. Thanks for watching.